This is Cutie Bun. Who's a cutie? Cutie Bun is. What magic power does it have? Well, that's Cutie Bun's power. It can make anyone who is close feel really fuzzy wuzzy inside because of its cuteness. Aww, isn't it cute? It sure is! Gucci Gucci Goo! Uh, Mila, wanna play? And a one, and a two, and a three! <laughs> <laughs> Morphle, we're playing with Cutie Bun. Morphle, cute too. We will play later, Morphle. Cutie Bun, come back. We love you. Look, Stein, this is the cutest magic pet I've ever seen. Wow. wow, so cute. This gives me a wonderful idea, Yorn. Oh no, the bandits have kidnapped Cutie Bun. Morphle, morph into... Huh? Where's Morphle? Good question. I guess we were a little too distracted by Cutie Bun. Let's find him. Who's a good kitty cat? You sure are. Morphle, we need your help. Mm, Mila no love for Morphle. Mila love a cutie bun. Mila does love Morphle, and I'm sorry you felt that way. But Cutie Bun's power made us love her more than, well, anything else. Morphle loving Mila and Daddy. And I love you too. Can you help us save Cutie Bun? The bandits have her. Oh no, Morphle, help! Hold it right there, bandits. Nobody informed me there was a parade, so join us. <laughs> Pretty soon, the whole town will be dreamy zombies like these. Yeah, and we will be able to steal all the stuff. Like this. Yoink, it's ours now. You go and show them how cute you can be, Morphle. On to our next victim, Yorn. Uh, Yorn? Look at it, Stein. So cute. Kitty is gone. Back to bandit business. Good to have you back, cutie. Now that's cute. Fun. 
Animi's powers to bring things to life never ceases to amaze me. Look, it's you, Animi. Only in the Mirror World. Can Mirror Animi come out and play with Animi? I do not think that would be such a good idea, Mila. The Mirror World Magic Pet's powers are, well, different. And sometimes they can cause trouble in our world. I'm sure it will be fine. Come on out. Mila! Morpho on the rush! Okay, let's go. Morpho, morph into a race car. Yay! Where do you think you're going? Come back here! Oh my, that's not good. Let's see if the mayor has finally replied to our complaints about the magic pets. Huh? Did, did I say complaints? <laughs> what I meant was... <laughs> No way! I need to go to the hospital to care for my patients! some tickets to write. I still need to go to the hospital. And I have a lady to save. I don't have anything to do. Ice creams for everyone. Ice cream. <laughs> Yay. on the window with your ball. Not in my police car. 
Buffo no break. You're going to jail. Huh? arrested him for breaking his window. But it broke when my wrench landed on it. It was an accident. Let's tell Police Officer Freeze what really happened so he can let Orful go. I'm looking for the invisible tickler. <laughs> not, not in my <laughs> city. I think I know who the invisible tickler is. Hello there, invisible tickler. <laughs> so Orful is the invisible tickler and the window breaker? No. I'm the real window breaker. I'm sorry. It was an accident until he has fixed it now. Oh, thank you. Orful, you are free. <laughs> <clears throat> and here's your ball back. Who wants to play soccer? Me, me! Oops! <laughs> <laughs> Like fun. Let's race Uncle Mortimer. Muffle faster. Muffle faster. Hmm. Let's race to the beach. Fastest magic pet wins. Like those people need our help. My bus broke down. Race? More for faster? Mm, we can still race. Morphle, morph into a bus. Oh no! Look! Lumberjill Mary is stuck in that tree! Morph into a flying bus to save her, Morphle! Rush! We can still win the race with rocket boosters!
to the hospital builder, Lawrence. Morphle, morph into an ambulance. Hi, Morpho! Bye, Morpho! Ha <laughs> ha! You are the fastest magic pet in the city! And Morphle wins the award for the most helpful magic pet in the city! No, no! It's also most helpful, too! Huh? Why, you! Come back here! I ought to... Oh. <laughs> Good morning. Ah, <sighs> uh, don't you just love camping in the woods? Morpho, hungry. Here you go. I've baked you some bread over the fire. Wow. Are you ready to go on an adventure in the woods? Yeah! I'm sure we can help it a bit by building a little bridge. Yeah, let's see. Morphle, morph into a robot and put that tree over the moat. Great job, Morphle. Now we can safely cross as well. Morphle, hungry again! Well, the forest is full of berries you can eat, like blackberries and raspberries. And I think I see some over there. Delicious. And nutritious. But let's head back to camp for a real meal. Mm. Do you see that bright star in the sky? That's the pole star. It always stays in the same place in the sky and guides us north. Wow, that's really cool. Oh, it sure is. But let's hit the sack, you guys. It's getting pretty late. Did you hear that, Morphle? 
What do you think it is? Monster bear! Don't be such a scaredy cat, Morphle. I'm sure there are no monsters in these woods. Come, I'll show you. What's so scary? There's nothing to fear here, Morphle. <laughs> See, Morphle, just a tree and a bird. <sighs> Let's go back to the camp. But which way is it? Morphle, hungry! We can find berries, just like Daddy showed us. These are raspberries. They're safe to eat, Morphle. Yummy! <laughs> okay, what more did Daddy teach us? Star! <gasps> yes, Morphle. Daddy showed us the pole star. Morph into a helicopter. Over there, Morphle, the pole star. Let's fly that way. That's Daddy! Mila, Morphle, where were you? I was worried sick. We're sorry, Daddy. We got lost. But we found our way back because of what you taught us. You did? That's wonderful. Do you want something to eat? You must be hungry after your adventure. Yeah! Brother, with the marshmallow and the berry. <laughs> Now that sounds like a Morphle sandwich. <laughs> Shh, please be quiet. Telefox is sleeping. I think Telefox has a bad dream. What happened? Look, we've been teleported into space. Don't worry, Telefox. You didn't do it on purpose. And Morphle can bring us home again. Yeah! Oh, no. There are a lot of asteroids about to hit the store. Morphle, morph into a robot. Morph into a big shield around the store. <laughs> you did it, Morphle. <laughs> now we can go home. But I can't see Earth anywhere. <gasps> Hi, Mr. Alien. Oh. Hello, fellow aliens. Do you know the way to Earth? Sure. Earth is that way. Thank you. Daddy, Earth is that way. Great. Let's go. That was close. Stop right there. We are space pirates. Give us that house you have. No, that's Daddy's magic pet store. Yeah. <laughs> then we'll just have to take it. into the shield again.
and Morphle. I can see Earth again. Yippee! You did it. Thank you, Morphle. <laughs> Mila, Morphle, there you are. I have built a rocket. Do you want to go to space with me? <laughs> no thanks, Professor Rashid. We've seen enough of space for today. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Mila and Morphle. Thank you for wanting to help me on the farm today. Of course. Making all the products on the farm is a lot of work. I can use some extra hands. Yeah. I'll show you how it's done. Let's go. First, we're going to milk a cow. From the milk, we can make delicious cheese. Cheese! All right, Morphle. Let's try to milk a cow as well. Hi, cow! Uh-oh. I think she got scared. Morph into a bull, Morphle. With a strong bull around, she won't be scared anymore. <laughs> we did it! We got our own milk. Well done. Milk cheese! <laughs> We can't do that in one day. <laughs> it takes months to make cheese, but as a reward, you'll get a piece of mine. Ooh, yummy! This here's where all the fruit grows. We're going to pick some fruit to make jam. <laughs> Daddy really likes jam. Wow, that's a lot of apples, Morphle. Lots of jam. <laughs> that's right. But how do we get all these apples to the barn? Why? Thank you, Morphle. <laughs> Making jam also takes a while. But you can get some I made earlier. Yippee! <laughs> and now we're going to shear a sheep for wool. And from its wool, we can make clothes. Like this warm scarf. Morphle, morph into scissors. Purple sheep! Oh no! Stop! Let's go after them before they get away. They're all back. Thank you, guys. As a reward, you get this woolen skull. Yay! Thank you, Farmer Bob. We learned a lot today. Oh, how lucky. I was feeling like having a snack. Mmm, delicious. Daddy, we've brought you some delicious. Oh, Daddy, you ate all the food. Oops, I'm sorry, Mila and Morphle. Yay! Farm again! Farm again! <laughs> Found you. <sighs> Hide 
and seek is too easy like this. Yeah. Why don't we make it a little harder? Huh? I will leave the room and you'll morph into an object in the house. Ooh, fun! <laughs> All right, here I come. I can't seem to find Morphle anywhere. Do you see him in the closet? No, I don't think so. Do you see him under the bed? No. Do you see him around the cabinet? Yeah! Yeah! There you are! You were really well hidden! Let's do it again! Yeah! Ah! Ready or not, here I come! Hmm, I can't see Morphle yet. Do you see Morphle around the couch? No. Can you see Morphle on the table? Yeah! Yay! Good job hiding, Morphle! All right, one last time. Go look for a place to hide. Here I come! Mila! Mila! Oh no! Morpho! Daddy, come quick! Look, Stein! New stuff! Maybe there's something we can use. <laughs> Wait, was that Morphle? Oh, oh, Lucky! Let's go get him! No, don't you see? That's way too easy. What do you mean? It must be a trap to arrest us again. Oh, no. Stein, what do we do? I don't want to go back to jail again. Let's bail. Ah, Stein, wait up. quite the adventure. Next time, don't hide yourself too far away. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we should just play this game inside. Yeah! <laughs>